Hello everybody, I'm Venturious Blackheart and welcome to Tom Dragon Tries. Today's game of choice is Coagulation Station. Something I found in each that IO uh, featured section. Uh, according to the description, you are in debt with the Galactic Bank, so you take up a job in a living planet where all food drives from this planet's blood. You will be running a blood station in this in hopes to repay the debt or become one of the company's accidents that they will proceed to cover up, probably. So, I said the, um, the screenshots and it looked pretty interesting, I'm not gonna lie. Don't normally do horror because this does fall into the uh, ambient horror thing, but if it's ambient horror, it means there's no jump scares or anything, so... Let's see how much it spooks me giving that I'm, I'm in my bed with a scary cat. So here we go. After a long string of poor financial decisions, you receive a telecommunication from the Grand Galactic Bank. They inform you that you have somehow managed to a, a, a a Q, sorry, my, uh, English is not my main language, so <laughs> sorry if I butcher some words. 53,000 kilo credits of debt. God damn. If your debt is not resolved within three months, we will enact standard debt relief protocols. Knowing the Grand Galactic Bank's debt relief protocols often involve the removal of several vital organs, uh, you figure it's best to look for a new, stable job to pay off your debt. After a night of searching, you find an opening for a clot management specialist aboard a pumping station on Carrion Prime. The pay is decent and the hours aren't too bad. It, it definitely beats a customer service. Personally, the turnover rate of this position is unusually high. Regardless, you've always wanted to visit Carrion Prime, and now seems like the perfect opportunity. Maybe you can even try one of their renowned clock dogs. How bad could it be? Which we're probably gonna find out. It is pretty bad. Like this, I throw aesthetic. I've always liked these games with their little retro aesthetic. Excuse you. You just brought me all the way down and you know, open the doors. Pipe operation guide, PDS operation. This guide is intended to aid in the operation of product delivery system, PDS. PDS is responsible for the initial extraction of the blood uh, thereafter product from the reservoir below. Product extraction is vital in supplying sustenance to the colony. Located, uh, located any of the four identical terminals. Uh, bearing the following pump symbol, press the metallic switch to cycle the pumps on or off. Observe the designated flow rate gauge located on the far wall. Op optimal performance is outlined by a number of, of lights illuminated. Please note, failure to meet the designated product quota will result in a mandatory contribution 
of product by any and all personnel involved. Contribution includes, but not limited to, partial or complete ex ex uh, green sequination. I'm assuming they're just gonna drain you of your blood and use that as product. Just need to wait till something goes wrong. At least that's what I'm assuming. Because here I can see where all the other stations are. You're not here. Great. You're here, all the way on the far side. Let's so have a look around while that. Why is the call lift button gone? Due to poor performance resulting for the increasingly frequent early departure of assigned personnel, the manual recall mechanism for the entry exit elevator has been disabled indefinitely. The elevator will now descend automatically once the protocol has been met. Further inquiries regarding the guided elevator protocol are discouraged. Focus your efforts on ma maximizing pro product output. The colony appreciates your unwavering dedication to the vital extraction of stock. What's that noise? Okay, so we have a problem somewhere. Right there, apparently. Where's the valve? Okay, never mind. Encountering leaks and blockages within product flow is. What in the nine devils was that? What was that? What did I miss? I'm kind of scared actually. Okay, all it says is fix if it breaks. Thought so grinder. Functions of. Uh, okay, that and covered in blood. from here. Oh. Bad. And of course it comes from me. That gooey stuff. Okay, something else is broken, apparently. I have buttons to turn it on and off everywhere, so I don't have to go absolutely everywhere just to uh, do that. Every rig is equipped with sensors to detect incoming search events. As e in for informal referred as a blood wave. SC are uncommon catastrophes, seismic events that occur without warning. Little is known about the cause, but our current understanding is that they originate from a colossal cardiac organism. Uh, knowing an event coming is critical survival, an alarm will sound. I'm 
assuming that it is something's going on, so that alarm is going off. Just in case, let's go back to it. Should we turn to the surface? I'm gonna call all the cells. Nothing's happening. I'm probably gonna die immediately. Unless I need to go down below to fix whatever is. Yes, there's something down below. If I have to go down and pull out whatever that is. And if there is a wave, I'm assuming put the suit on and get underneath the wave. If this is um, a living being, shouldn't there be like, I don't know, antibodies trying to eat me? Maybe? Man, this looks... I see some parts like barely in the background. Hopefully you guys can actually see it. I do not like the sound of that. I do not like the sound of that, really. Hang on. I went a little too far. Maybe that's the problem. open. Do I actually need to go down? Wait, no, I got a better idea. Go back up. Because that was just going and going. The pipe's not that deep. Maybe there's a platform I don't know of. Take the diving suit though, because it is underneath. Maybe I went to the wrong one. I have death 80. But how do I know which one? I need to actually see it again. I don't know what I'm doing, okay? I'm pretty sure the moment I do figure it out, I'm gonna die. Does this see which pipe it is? Okay, that path 37. creepy wait due to recent events uh, the harpoon should remain locked unless authorized by a member of staff hopefully I don't actually need that 
So I don't need to go that deep, but how do I then get off? Not like I saw any platform anywhere. It's gonna be probably another lift. Okay, here's another lift. Okay, given that this is here, it must mean that this is the right one. Okay, yeah, it is this, this, minus 35. This one will stop at that point, I'm assuming. is this pipe. I do not like the sound of that. Okay, so it was that pipe. I just simply wasted my time on the other left. Maybe that pipe doesn't exist yet. Yet. Oh man, I need so much quota. Just a of waiting for something to pop. <laughs> no! Jesus, that's fucking good. Oh, that actually scared the shit out of me. Maybe they should lead us. Use this, maybe, just in case that happens again. Oh, my God. Am I supposed to do something with that thing? So yeah, I guess this thing has parasites in it. Still working. I want you that one because that's like the nearest one. Oh no, never mind, it's right there. See this one. This floor vein. Why does that look like there's something looking at me there? I don't want to 
I'm supposed to be looking for here? Oh. Intake C is gone. Okay, that's intake B, which is uh, 33. Wrong button. I'm probably on the wrong one again. Yeah, that looks like an eyeball over there. And I just noticed this one's damaged. It doesn't take B, I went to the wrong one again. I'm dumb. Wait, where's the suit? Is there really only one suit? Or two suits? What? Okay, kinda got stuck there for a second. I might as well take this suit. But once I'm done with it, I'm bringing it back to the A because the A is closer. stay down here any longer than what I have to. I don't like it, I'm scared. Alright, this guy's brave or stupid. I would not take a job like this. There seems to be something that keeps on getting me stuck. fixes that. Let's see. Alright, I 
be keeping an eye on that. Right. Uh, it's definitely not going towards the uh, first one. Oh no, it's probably headed straight for me. I completely forgot about that thing. Why does this look like a corpse? Which isn't, isn't that moving in too fast, hopefully. Wait, I just think about it. Wasn't that number higher a moment earlier? Or did I actually lose some? Wait, what was that? Did I just see something moving on that camera? I swear I saw something moving over there. There's definitely something moving down there. Okay, this is the A one. Now I'm gonna leave it on. I knew something was alive. I knew something was alive over here. Ooh, that looked big. I don't want to come back down here. That was one big parasite inside of this humongous monster. Especially since I don't have any more power, that means uh, no list for me. Oh, right, I forgot about that. I'd say, I think it's coming even faster now. Because it probably took so long to figure things out. Giant fish. Good thing this fish is, is dead. I'm gonna die, ain't I? I'm, I'm sure I'm gonna die. I mean, that wave is moving oh so fast, honestly. And now I know, like, yeah, even if I go down there, I'm pretty much still screwed. Oh, I can take that suit and bring it here. Once I see this game, like, really close, I'm gonna grab a suit from A and actually bring it up here. 
Like it's like around that spot right there. Okay, I just noticed a timer. So maybe once I have like two minutes left, I'm gonna bring it. Unless like that way, it's just gonna make sure. Wait, what's in this black? Breaking here. Pipe C. Except the C's camera is broken. So I can't even see it. And that's that really deep. to be the broken gauge. Safe at depth 80, please don't say. No, I just heard another one. Kind of side comment. After he failed to report in the following day, uh, he searched he was dispatched. They discovered what was left of you several hours later. Your remains were then sent to the Grand Galactic Bank's Oregon Harvesting Center. Was there anything left to harvest? At least you don't have to worry about that when you're dead, right? Ultimately, this was the latest tragedy in a long line of tragedies to occur at the pumping station. Nevertheless, as long as the demand for clock dogs is high, the plot must be pumped. Not long after the job listing for a clock manager specialist opened once more. Dark ending? You, you tell me there's multiple endings for this thing? You're telling me that there's actually a, a way to actually win this. It's probably the ending which you actually get destroyed by that giant wave, probably. I'm sure of it. Is there even a way to... let me know in the comments below. Is there an ending where you actually, um, live? For those that may have played this. And for those who want to try this game themselves, the link will be down on the description below. I'll let the credits uh, go so that we can see everyone involved in the making of this very spooky game. I'm not gonna lie, I was scared uh, <laughs> quite a bit. After seeing the silhouette and uh, the background, that very silhouette, I was like, oh boy, I'm dead either way, apparently. It's 
probably end anywhere between you don't do anything, you let just a timer go, and you <laughs> you still lie by the hands of the bank. And that's they should have had to eat in the entire cage to catch me. Oh, oh, kitty. And yeah, that's, that's gonna be it for Dungeon and Tries. Like I said, again, a great atmosphere. It was definitely spooky. It did scare me. That little tiny jump scare that I did not see coming. <laughs> they like, get me. Like, I'm my heart pumping by the way, but. Oh boy, I'm still uh, recovering a little bit because the ambient was indeed spooky. That, that just like it said in the description. It, uh, so uh, I'm still recovering a little bit from that little scare. I did try not to scream because uh, like, for those who watch my stream know that there is a baby in the house. I don't want to traumatize the baby. I did not expect something like that uh, coming. But anyways. That video's gone long enough, so uh, if you have any suggestions of any other any other game I should try out, particularly any like indie game that's gone unnoticed or, not, or underrated, let me know down in the comments below. So, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed today's video, and I hope to see you all next time. Bye bye.